Well, as you know, grocery shopping has certainly become challenging these days, especially when it comes to produce. And that means for many people, an investment in foods that have a longer shelf life with uh, the most uh, uh, nourishing uh, ingredients during, of course, this pandemic. And keeping your produce selections healthy and clean and safe is, of course, the concern of a lot of people. Certified nutritionist and celebrity health coach Karina Heinrich joins us today with important tips. Good morning. Thank you so much for joining us. You know, the other day we did a story and um, we were talking about all the things you need to do, you know, going to the grocery store, wearing the mask, and then getting back home, washing it and cleaning off all the products. And I said, I just don't have that kind of time. It's like a, like I'm adding another hour onto my morning or my day. Um, is it really that necessary to, to go through all that? You know, I mean, people are scared to buy fresh produce right now. Just like you said, they're afraid of getting coronavirus transferred to their food. Does it matter if someone with coronavirus coughs, sneezes, talks, or breathes too close to the apple you're about to put in your cart? That being said, you know, we know that the Center of Disease Control and Prevention say that it's mainly passed through respiratory droplets. But regardless if we have, you know, a, pandem a pandemic or not, we should be taking those extra measures to clean our produce, whether before consuming or even cutting into that produce. The University of Massachusetts Amherst research has found that soaking apples in a baking soda solution removed much more pesticides and cleaning with water alone. Mm. So it really does Ooh. matter regardless of what's going on. Okay, so in recent years, there's been a proliferation of um, organic Produce. A lot of people looking for items that don't have pesticides on them. But when it comes to COVID-19, I would imagine most produce is the same when it comes to the best way to clean it. Absolutely. There's so many hands touching your produce right now, and we want to take those extra precautions. So I have a really easy do it yourself. You can do it at home with ingredients that are safe that you have at home. Anyone, if you have a spray bottle at home, you fill it with one cup of filtered water two tablespoons of baking soda, one tablespoon of lemon juice. You can just squeeze some fresh lemon. Mm. You put that on your produce for about five minutes, wash it off. The reason why I love this is these are all healthy ingredients. So if you happen to not wash it all off, it's okay. And it's been proven to reduce those extra pesticides and help keep all that produce as clean as possible. Well, that's all goodness that, that you're bringing home from the, pro from the uh, grocery store shelves into your home. It's all goodness eventually making it into your body. Can you tell us, are there any health the produce in particular that you think people should be including in their diets right now in order to you know to keep our immune systems up and in fighting condition absolutely so what you want to be doing right now I mean it's hard to find the produce you're used to buying so you need to think outside the box you want to make sure you're buying produce that has the highest fiber vitamins nutrients and those antioxidants so in our house in the Heinrich house we're buying berries like blackberries and raspberries because I know this has the highest fiber we're buying apples kiwi bananas and then vegetables we're buying spinach broccoli carrots sweet potatoes mm. so I'm always yeah. thinking of those ingredients to put on the top of my shop list to look for and if I don't find that then I that's when I start thinking outside the box and buying whatever greens I can kind of get for my family that's high in vitamin C and those antioxidants all right Karina Heinrich she is a certified nutritionist and celebrity health coach thanks so much for your time this morning thank you so much for having me